Every one of us in life, when we beat ourselves up with mistakes that we made, it's a bad thing. The what ifs and the if onlys will beat you up, right? So when you make a decision at whatever stage it was in your life and it turned out to be the wrong one, guess what? We all do it. We all make wrong decisions. We all screw up. We all make mistakes. And, you know, to come to grips with that and not beat yourself up over it, but be able to walk away and, and live a healthy, uh, uh, emotional life uh, where you can connect. It's about connecting, you know, first with yourself and other people and being real and listening. And um, so I don't think I would change it. I don't think if I had the opportunity, I think I'd do it just exactly the way I did it. I, I, never, I never realized the redeeming value of, you know, we go back and we think like this, we think like this. Well, or maybe we don't think like this, but I was on the verge of alcoholism before I was drafted, right? No doubt about it. I was a case a day, bottle of seven crown in a night, and get up, go to work the next day, and do it again the next night. So I get drafted, there's no drinking allowed. I mean, you do, but you're a nom, you're not drinking. So in my, you know, wacky kind of thinking, Vietnam saved me from being an alcoholic. Alcoholism's hell, Vietnam is hell, but one saved me from the other. So if, you're, if you can figure that out, you're a better man than I, <laughs> right? But, but my, you got my point? You, to, go, to redo it? No, no, that's back to the future. You know, that, I don't think that stuff works. I, I think the best part about it is, is that even if you did do something stupid and you did make a big mistake, it's okay, you know? Uh, learn how to forgive yourself. Learn how to, how to realize that you're not alone. That's what they do in therapy. See, one of the things with PTSD is you think you're the only one that's going through it. Nobody understands what I'm going through, right? Nobody understands. That's the biggest lie of all, because we're not alone. Everybody goes through cancer, divorce, traffic accidents, loss of limb. God only knows what, all this horrible stuff, right? Everybody goes through it. We're not alone. You don't get a free ride here. Everybody pays. So... Coming to grips, I don't know if it takes 73 years to come to grips with all that stuff. Maybe it did. But, you know, I look at it like this. Vietnam, for me, was an event I wouldn't trade for a million bucks. But I wouldn't give you five cents to go back again and do it, right? But I wouldn't trade it. No, no, no. It was an integral part of my life. See, the negative things are as much a part of our life as the positive things and the right things and the good things and the things that turn out right. And I think that's what's really at the core of the book. And that's what took on the life. That's where it was going. I wasn't even guiding the pencil. I mean, it was unbelievable because every, the analogies that I draw, you know, in Kaleidoscope and uh, Lucy and, and uh, I'm trying to think of some of the chapters, but uh, you know, the core of the majority of the chapters is, is that it's not over. You know, it, it's okay. It's okay. If you goofed up, it's okay if it didn't work. You're going to be all right. You know, the therapist used to talk to me that way. Okay, Ken, your hour's up. You can go home now. You know, like, <laughs> thanks. You know, you just, you, just, you just put my whole life on the table and now I can go home, <laughs> right? <laughs> but it's true. The irony is that it's true. You know, that's then, now is now, and life is okay. You know, you don't have to sleep under a bridge. You don't have to dive into a, you know, b bottle of Jim Beam. You, you, you don't really have to do that. That's what's in the book. That's what I wanted to put in the book. 
Let me phrase it that way. That's what I wanted to impregnate that book with on every page. Because you see, it starts the first page, I got a smile on my face, right? Got my M16 here. The last page, same thing. Starts on an up, ends on an up. I think that's the way life is. That's what it taught me anyway.